Salutations, friends. It's your pal, Sid Stevie, and I got uh, something that I've really been anticipating to check out in. And if that is any indication, you should know what's in here. Or I'm sure you've already read the thumbnail uh, title of this video. But uh, this uh, unboxing knife, by the way, is going to be my PM Mac 2, my McNeese. Love it! Always got to point out that this has a wicked sharp edge from clean and work quality sharpening. Kyle sharpens? What? Uh, in the description of every video, you can get the link to clean and work. Uh, quality sharpenings uh, YouTube or excuse me um, Instagram page and you can uh, hit up Kyle if you want uh, some sharpening done. I promise you uh, it will go well so let's see what we got inside here what do we got ooh I got some stickers from uh, 814 EDC uh, from Alex over there. So, awesome. So, this is a knife that has been passed around in Lefty EDC's uh, group. And, uh, yeah. So, here we go. It's another giant mouse. Uh, and quick uh, beverage check. I got my uh, giant mouse uh, coffee mug out. No coffee in it. Uh, I'm still drinking this uh, Dr. Pepper... Uh, zero Sugar Cherry. Um, yeah, I got it, so I got to drink it up, but uh, yeah, it's okay. It wets the whistle. Here we go. Uh, this is in the Ace lineup, obviously, from Giant Mouse. And uh, this is the uh, Atelier. I don't think I'm pronouncing that right, but the uh, Atelier in Titanium. And the reason why I'm stoked to check this out is because it's a mini version of one of my favorite crappy knives. My crappiest favorite knife, I should say. Uh, this is heavy. Uh, this is the titanium version. So, uh, here we go. There it is. Uh, I guess kind of the stonewashed, colored, gray titanium that does have some nice uh, micro milling in it. Uh, brass backspacer, uh, loop over wire pocket clip, as all giant mouse uh, ace uh, knives do. And yeah, so this is basically a mini grand. Uh, you have a flipper or no flipper tab on this. This is just a slot for deployment. And uh, let's check it out. Give it a flick. Okay. Fairly snappy there. Not bad. Um. Man, this is actually, uh, it's as big as I thought it would be, because I've seen pictures on it, but, um, I thought maybe it would be too small, and this ain't bad. Uh, here it is for comparison against the aforementioned, my favorite, shittiest knife. This is the full-size grand. Yeah. Um, if I give it gas... Boom, there it goes. But, yeah, this thing has had all sorts of problems. I can't center it. Uh, pivot won't stay tight unless I completely lock tight it and wrench it all the way down. Uh, you might say, hey, have you tried this? Have you tried that? The answer is yes. I've tried everything with this knife. Uh, detent ball falling out uh, before. I reached out to Giant Mouse. I bought this on the secondary, and there was uh, no, no help for that. But... I love this knife. I really do love the Grand. Everything about it. So, when they said they were doing the uh, mini version, I thought maybe I would dig it. And I do. I would like it probably a lot more if it was just a little bit bigger. But this size absolutely makes sense. Uh, I don't think that the titanium would be my jam. Uh, I would go with one of the... Uh, micarta versions but uh, I'm digging this uh, you have steel liners on here uh, yeah oh, oh and it's it's not gonna say because it's on the inside of the liners 
but this is in Elmac, or no, I guess it does say it on the uh, blade. I'm wrong. Uh, it's in Elmax. Does it say that on here? No. So on the Grand, on the uh, inside of the liners is where it says that it's in Elmax uh, Super Clean, I think. I don't know if that's a different uh, version of Elmax than this, but uh, this is a made in uh, Italy knife in uh, Montiago, I believe, Italy is where the OEM is on this. Another Ace, uh, or another design in the Ace lineup from Vox and Anso. Uh, really dig their design language. One of my favorite uh, d designer combos of all time. I think they do a phenomenal job. Met both of them. Pretty cool dudes. Uh, let's go over some specs real quick, because uh, I do have them uh, pulled up. So, the... Uh, the Atelier, 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 uh, this is a 2.875 inch blade, whereas this is a 3.3 three uh, inch blade. You have a, a handle length on here of 4 inch. You have a handle length of 4.5 inch. Uh, an overall length here of 6.8 and an overall length here of 7.87. So about a half inch in uh, each direction there uh on the blade and i guess if we're going pivot to pivot uh yeah so i dig it i really do uh is it going to be something that i get i just might i just might uh however i do have a rule with giant mouse now that uh, i will not buy a giant mouse that I have not handled myself first. So maybe this is something I'll pick up at a Blade Show? I don't know. We shall see. Uh, the going price for these, uh, so they have this one specifically listed on Blade Ops for 285 bucks. I think that is the going price. Um, I'll put my Blade Ops uh, affiliate link in the description if you are interested. Uh, in either of these uh, from Blade Ops, they have the green micarta uh, as well, which is 215 bucks. So, you know, I guess it's not uh, too bad of a deal. 215 bucks for uh, green micarta and Elmax. Uh, okay, I don't really have a problem with that. Um, but uh, where I think you get a good value, and I don't have an affiliate link uh, by any means, but... Uh, Lynch Northwest is a giant mouse uh, dealer, and you can actually order uh, there uh, from them for an extra ten bucks. You can get uh, the uh, same green canvas micarta with a Lynch Northwest deep carry clip for two hundred and twenty-five, or the red canvas micarta for two hundred and twenty-five, or you can step up to the uh, carbon fiber. And get the uh, get that for two hundred fifty five, and then these do come with uh, a deep carry, a Lynch Northwest deep carry clip on them, and then you have different options. Uh, there's a little bit of an upgrade. Uh, you can even get one of their carbon fiber clips uh, for for this. So a little bit of an upgrade uh, from them. Again, I don't uh, have an affiliate with them. I'm just a big fanboy of uh, Lynch Northwest. And I think they look good on their knives. Uh, case in point, uh, let's see here. Here is my Nimbus uh, V2 sporting a uh, Lynch Northwest clip. And, you know, I really do think the Nimbus is my favorite of the uh, Giant Mouse knives. These dogs are going crazy. Uh, I love the Nimbus. Took me a minute to get used to, but... Um, I really, I really do like the Nimbus, and a Lynch Northwest clip looks good on it. Uh, here I have the Ace Nazca, uh, their crossbar lock. Uh, this one was OEM'd by Best Tech, and it's sporting a Lynch Northwest clip. So, a uh, good case in point with this, I actually bought this from Vox at Blade Show last year, and uh, the first one I handled was the titanium one. I didn't like it. It was too heavy. 
Uh, they handed me the green... This is green micarta, by the way. It's just been patinaed a lot. Uh, it was not... It did not have good action on it. I said, I can't buy this one. They went through two other ones and found one that I actually uh, did like. Um, and so uh, I bought that. Um, hold on. I can't get my uh, little yappy dog to stop uh, yapping, so I guess you guys will just have to put up with that. Sorry! Uh, and then this isn't a giant mouse knife, but this is a Vox design, uh, my dapper, uh, with a Lynch Northwest clip on it. And yeah, I think uh, these uh, Lynch makes a good wire clip uh, replacement. So, and they actually have dedicated giant mouse uh, wire clip replacements now. So, but any hoodles, uh, back to the uh, mini grand here, the Atelier. Atelier. Um, ergos are spot on. Uh, this little uh, landing spot with jimping is actually really good. Uh, as good as the ergos are on the, uh, the grand, I, I think that the ergos on this are phenomenal. Uh, you can write up, even though that's not really a choil, you can write up in this. I absolutely love this. Uh, you can see I'm not even sporting a pocket clip on this because I know it'll never get pocket time. Um, as good as the ergos are on this, for this small of a knife... Ergos are money, man. Absolute money. Uh, not a single hot spot whatsoever. Uh, this is a very useful uh, blade shape, in my opinion. Uh, and I'd say that uh, I, I I will absolutely recommend this knife. Uh, again, uh, 285 bucks for the titanium. You make that call, uh, I think you're getting better value with 215 uh, getting one of the canvas micarta. Uh, versions, but yeah, the way they round off the spine of the knife is done really well. The way they uh, round off the inside of the blade, uh, the jimping that they put on their liners, uh, and that's something that they do on uh, all their knives. Uh, that you know, they always add some jimping there uh, on the liners. Uh, I don't know if that's a Vox thing or what, but uh, he's always got jimping. Dapper, by the way, if you don't own a Dapper, you're missing out. Uh, this is a Blade HQ exclusive. Uh, but this is one of the best small knives of all time, in my opinion. But uh, that's not a... This is not a review on the Dapper. Uh, this is on the Atelier. Atelier. I can't remember how to pronounce it, and I've said that a thousand times. But, yeah, I dig this knife. Uh, so... Again, I will put my Blade Ops affiliate links in there, and then I'll also put the Lynch Northwest uh, link uh, down in there if you want to check those out. But, yeah, I am a Giant Mouse fan. I just got a love-hate relation with ship with them. Uh, this is my Morbid Mouse, uh, my Titanium Morbid Mouse. Uh, that is a, um, a bottle opener, cap lifter. Uh, I just use it for some pocket jewelry. I got a steal on this. I don't remember where I got it, but I, I think I got it for like 50 bucks. So, pretty cool. Um, and then also, uh, yeah, if you're wondering why I have uh, the uh, this coin out, uh, this is the uh, EDC Roundtable one-year anniversary challenge coin that's available on EDC Roundtable right now. Uh, we are selling these on the website, and every purchase of one of these is going to get you an entry into the one-year anniversary EDC Roundtable giveaway that has stuff uh, uh, from everybody on the Roundtable. You got Lancelot Leather, you got Jack's Lungs, you have Forest Hanks, you have Chromatic EDC, our newest uh, um, member, you got Mastranza Blades, and you got uh, yours truly, said Stevie. So there's going to be some awesome stuff. So this will be linked in the description as well. So... Yeah, and then um, I wanted to do, also, if you've made it this far into the video, uh, I got a bunch of Giant Mouse swag when Giant Mouse did this uh, little fall tour. They did a four-city fall tour. They went to uh, New York, Boston, Seattle, and Portland. And when they were in Seattle, 
uh, I picked up uh, some swag from them. It's got some schmutz on it, so you don't have to just deal with that. But I uh, got that uh, commemorative uh, sticker, and then uh, this keychain uh, coin as well. It was done at CC uh, Filson Anniversary. Or CC Filson, I'm sorry. I read Anniversary. Uh, yeah, they were having an anniversary at CC Filson, and they just uh, did a little pop up uh, in, the, in the store there. And then I got this uh, giant mouse uh, koozie. Uh, knives done right. Uh, I don't remember where I got this, but I got it. So I figured I'd do a little giveaway here. Uh, what's the giveaway going to be? Uh, how am I going to do it? Okay, I'm thinking this on the fly. But um, let's see here. How about you tell me... Hmm, hold on. I haven't thought this through. Okay, I'm really drawing a blank here. I thought I was going to come up with something on the fly, but... Alright, so since I am drinking some Dr. Pepper uh, Zero Sugar uh, Soda Pop, why don't you leave a comment uh, with what your favorite soda pop is? And how about this? On said Stevie Live, coming up on... When's my next live? Uh, okay, so this is going to post on Thursday, May 4th. My next Said Stevie Live is on Saturday, May 13th. So between now, when this video posts, and uh, my live stream, I will do a ram random comment picker uh, on... I'll do it live, and uh, this will be your chance to win uh, the Giant Mouse um, little swag pack here. So, how about that? Does that sound good? That's all I could think of right now. But, uh, yeah, that's all I got for you folks. Um, appreciate you tuning in. Uh, let me know what you think of the Mini Grand here. And until the next one... Um, I appreciate you tuning in. Oh, don't forget to subscribe right here. Don't forget to like that video. And until the next one, I bid you mofos. Adieu.